You are listening and watching to a very special podcast. All right, here we have more on Lola Nikita as she and the others are still in the Wonderland. And by the others, I mean Kimisuki, Yoichi, and Maggie. So, yes, please enjoy. Pansy was leading them right down this hall. But before then, she was supposed to tell them, but with all those crazy female corruptions around, she lost the track. Ah, uh, yes. I almost forgot. <laughs> How silly of me. Remember when you saw... And I'm talking to Lola and Kimizuki, who knows. But anyway. <clears throat> okay. Remember when you saw... Guerrero's power of when she ripped her heart out of her chest. Uh, yeah? What about it? Lola said. I believe Rosemary had done it. And we all have that ability. Really? It's a trait of the Fury. Wait. The trait of the Fury? That's what a Fury is supposed to represent. Furies come in all shapes and sizes. In the mythology, it says their hair is made out of snakes, and they're very dangerous, and they're very, very furious, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Pansy said with a small laugh. So that's a form of a fury, but I never seen a harpy, nor ever did I see a banshee. The banshee form is quite typical. Your appearance changed into some sort of, well, more like a purplish reddish kind, not the red kind like Maggie's, but very much more vibrant. And then, your flowers become more like thorns and wilted f little flourish things. And let's not even f go on with the whole idea of decapitation against others. And very much more lethal would be. And then, you have weeds around in the flower crown, especially in your hair. That's what a banshee is supposed to represent. That's why they're known as Ophelias, named after our mother. That sounds interesting, Yoichi said. Yeah, I never thought of it that way. Kimizuki said, but why go through all that trouble? Well, that's the first form. But then when we get very, very deranged. You remember when we absorbed the powers of the vampires? We can do that without absorbing that, but that was basically the harpy. You saw that we had claws. We had very, very sharp nails. And we also had deranged look in our eyes, didn't we? The banshee is supposed to, but not as bad as the harpy. That is what the harpy is. So that's what the harpy resembled. Mm-hmm. Aaron Yeager managed to find that out from Rosemary. Same with John, same with Barrere. And that's when you all should know of who you're dealing with. My dear friends, it would be rather tragic if that ever happened to you. Very much more, the harpy can be quite deranged. Dangerous, you might say. Lola was just startled by this. However, Pansy said in a monotone, but also you have to understand like I said about the corruption, you need to be aware of yourselves. These corruptions are not your friends. And you really shouldn't trust 
what kind of manipulation they put you against. So be warned. And if you don't heed well, then you will suffer the consequences, Pansy said. Pansy seemed a bit calmer than she was before. However, Yoichi made a, an attempt trying to talk to her, but Pansy just swat him away. Kimizuki said, Hey! However, Pansy screeched, Leave me! I just need some sleep, she said calmly. So Pansy was left to go rest somewhere while they looked around. But during that time, they came across some large and hunchback of a man, and he seemed to have little intelligence, but he spoke in the third person. Lola was startled to see him after hearing his laugh. His laugh was the one that startled them. <laughs> Dumpsy's got friends. Oh, oh hi. Dumpsy is good to meet friends. Dumpsy wants to meet friends. Uh, hi. We're just looking around. <laughs> Nothing to it, really. <laughs> yeah, could you excuse us for a moment? Kimizuki said, Don't leave. Dumpsy's got food. Dumpsy wants to know if you are hungry. Dumpsy managed to say, No, thanks. But that was a nice gesture, Lola said nicely. Dumpsy has no one to eat food. All I want to know is if you like Dumpsy's food. <sighs> Lola sighed. All right, all right, we'll try it. <laughs> Yay, Dumpsy will be very, very happy. Are you sure Pansy's gonna kill us? If Pansy kills us, so be it. So they went into the room and they saw what looked to be mushroom chicken with mixed vegetables. Dumpsy urged them. Dumpsy wants you to try. Dumpsy wants you.